And now this is an absolutely fantastic car. And I just think if it looked like that, it would be the best car ever. Absolutely ever. Absolutely. But anyway, isn't it time you put a star in our reasonably priced car? Yes, I'm sort of delaying it really, because obviously last week we had, well, we had a very intelligent, beautiful, lesbian, um, <laughs> gun and muscle car enthusiast, and this week we've got the exact opposite of that. So, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> make some noises, please, for John Prescott. Thanks for those that cheered. <laughs> and those that booed, well, you know what you can do. <laughs> I don't know where to start with you. <laughs> I was there wondering about that. So many questions. And I think the one that rises to the surface is, what in the name of all that's holy were you thinking when you said, let's put a bus lane on the M4? <laughs> I'm glad you've said that. Now, Jeremy, I'm going to introduce you to a revolutionary thought. You can go slower and get there quicker. And that's to do with flow. As soon as you made it two lane and brought it to 70 or 50, they got there quicker, actually. Cars as well. Well, I'm, don't take my word, take the independent transport research. And it meant, no, that the flow of the traffic was better, there were less accidents, less deaths. I think that's an important factor. You just want to speed everywhere, right? If I was but in reality, what we've seen is the deaths on children and deaths of adults. There aren't any children on the M4 bus lane. <laughs> it's a motorway. There are no schools there. They used to be able to drive into London on three lanes. You made it two, yeah. you put a speed camera up, you made it 50. That was daft. And it meant, no, that the flow of the traffic was better because people aren't rushing to the two lane from three. And I've heard motorists get, and I hear them all cheering here, but don't you get annoyed when somebody wants to push in, well, actually, when you've done your three and your two? Every, how many people get annoyed at that when they come down to three and they oh, come very down good. to two? Public come meeting. on, put your hands up. You know they are. They are. And they John, get bloody well up. Sit down. <laughs> Sit down. It goes... Right. Hey, they're cheering for me, not you. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. Let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. If you believe that narrowing a motorway causes the traffic flow to be improved, why did you widen the M25 and the M1? 